in the dynamic world of entertainment. Henry Winkler stands out as a true trailblazer. Born in 1945 in New York City, Winkler defied the odds and became one of the most beloved actors of his generation. He is best known for his iconic role as Arthur Fonzi Fonzarelli in the hit TV show Happy Days, which aired from 1974 to 1984. Winkler's portrayal of the cool, leather-jacketed Fonzi endeared him to millions of fans around the world and cemented his place in television history. But Winkler's accomplishments go far beyond his work on Happy Days. Over the course of his long and varied career, he has appeared in numerous films and TV shows, including Arrested Development, Parks, and Recreation, and Barry. He has also written a series of best-selling children's books and produced several successful TV shows. Despite facing numerous challenges and setbacks along the way, Winkler has remained a constant force in the entertainment industry. His contributions to the world of acting, writing, and producing have left an indelible mark on the industry and continue to inspire new generations of artists and creators. Winkler's story is one of perseverance, determination, and a deep love for the craft of acting. From his humble beginnings in New York City to his rise to fame on Happy Days, Winkler has always stayed true to himself and his passions. And in doing so, he has created a legacy that will endure for years to come. Henry Winkler is a well-known actor, best recognized for his role as Fonzie in the classic TV show Happy Days. He has been in the entertainment industry since the 1970s e and continues to be a prominent figure today. What makes Henry Winkler stand out from his contemporaries is his ability to play relatable and authentic characters that resonate with audiences. His performances are often marked by their humor, warmth, and genuine emotion. Winkler's enduring qualities, such as his talent, dedication, and versatility, have made him an everlasting symbol of the industry. He has left a lasting impact on the entertainment world and continues to inspire new generations of actors and fans alike. Do you have a cherished memory or personal experience related to Henry Winkler? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Throughout this video, we will share many funny, shocking, and sad facts about Henry Winkler, so be sure to keep watching. Henry Winkler was born in New York City in 1945 to parents Harry and Ilse Winkler who were Holocaust survivors. His family's experiences and resilience shaped his worldview and work ethic. Winkler's father owned a lumber company while his mother was a homemaker. He has two siblings, a brother and a sister. Winkler's interest in acting began in his childhood. He attended McBurney School in Manhattan where he participated in school plays. He later pursued a Bachelor of Arts degree in drama from Emerson College in Boston. During his early career, Winkler struggled to find acting roles due to his height and accent. However, he persevered and landed his breakthrough role as Fonzie in the hit TV show Happy Days in 1974. Key influences and mentors in Winkler's life include his parents, who instilled in him the importance of hard work and determination. He has also credited his acting teacher, Stella Adler, for her guidance and inspiration. Adler's teachings helped Winkler develop his craft and find success in the industry. Winkler's career has spanned over five decades, and he has become a beloved figure in Hollywood. He has won numerous awards for his work, including three Emmy Awards and a Golden Globe Award. Winkler continues to act and produce, inspiring aspiring actors and entertainers with his talent and dedication. Henry Winkler, an American actor, became famous for his role as Fonzie in the popular 1970s TV show Happy Days. His portrayal of the cool, leather-jacketed character had a significant impact on the film industry and popular culture. Winkler's performance made the Fonzie character a cultural icon, and his famous catchphrase, Aye, is still widely recognized today. Beyond happy days, Winkler has enjoyed a long and successful career in Hollywood. He has appeared in numerous TV shows and movies, including Arrested Development, Parks and Recreation, and The Waterboy. Winkler has also worked as a director and producer, contributing to the industry in various ways. Winkler's impact on the film industry extends beyond his on-screen work. He is also known for his advocacy for people with dyslexia, as he himself has the learning disorder. Winkler has used his platform to raise awareness about dyslexia and to help those who struggle with it. In summary, Henry Winkler has made significant contributions to the film industry through his acting, directing, and producing work. 
His iconic role as Fonzie in Happy Days had a lasting impact on popular culture, and his advocacy for people with dyslexia has made a difference in many lives. Henry Winkler, a well-known actor, first discovered his passion for acting in his high school drama class. He was cast in the lead role of a play, which he found both thrilling and fulfilling. This experience sparked his desire to pursue a career in acting. Winkler's interest in acting was further fueled when he took a theater course at Emerson College in Boston. During a class exercise, he was asked to act like a turtle. While other students struggled, Winkler embraced the challenge and gave a memorable performance. This moment solidified his passion for acting and his determination to succeed in the field. Despite facing various challenges and rejections early in his career, Winkler persevered and eventually landed the iconic role of Fonzie in the hit TV show, Happy Days. This role not only brought him fame and recognition, but also solidified his love for acting. Winkler's passion for acting has also led him to explore other aspects of the craft, such as writing and producing. He has written several books for children and young adults, as well as created and produced TV shows. Through these endeavors, Winkler continues to inspire and entertain audiences of all ages. Henry Winkler starred as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli in the hit sitcom Happy Days. He was mentored by actress Marion Ross and played the role for all 255 episodes. Winkler made up a gag where the Fonz doesn't comb his hair, which became a trademark. Aaron Morin mentioned that Winkler would kiss her and Marion Ross frequently off camera. Henry Winkler, the beloved actor famous for his role as Fonzie in Happy Days, faced many challenges on his journey to success. Born into a Jewish family in New York, Winkler struggled with dyslexia, a learning disorder that affects reading ability, which made his academic life difficult to attend. Despite this, he pursued his passion for acting and faced skepticism from the industry due to his lack of formal training. Financial struggles were also a significant obstacle for Winkler. He comes from a modest background and his family could not afford to send him to acting school. However, Winkler's resilience and determination led him to find creative solutions. He sought out free acting classes, attended workshops, and observed other actors to hone his craft. Winkler's big break came when he was cast as Fonzie in Happy Days. Initially, the producers were unsure if he was right for the role, but Winkler's charm and talent won them over. Fonzie became an iconic character, and Winkler's performance resonated with audiences worldwide. Despite his success, Winkler continued to face challenges in the industry. He was often typecast as Fonzie and had difficulty finding roles that allowed him to showcase his full range as an actor. However, Winkler remained resilient and continued to pursue his passion for acting. He took on various roles in film and television, including comedies, dramas, and even voiceover work. Winkler's experience with dyslexia also led him to become an advocate for people with learning disabilities. He wrote a series of children's books about a young boy with dyslexia, which aimed to raise awareness and understanding of the condition. In conclusion, Henry Winkler's journey to success was filled with obstacles, from financial struggles to industry skepticism. However, his resilience and determination allowed him to find creative solutions and overcome these challenges. His contributions to the entertainment industry and advocacy for people with learning disabilities have left a lasting impact. Henry Winkler, best known for his role as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli on Happy Days, was once considered for the part of Danny Zuko in Greece. However, he declined the role due to fears of being typecast and his inability to sing. Ironically, Fonzie was not the physical type Gary Marshall had in mind when envisioning the character. He had initially thought of someone resembling Sylvester Stallone or Perry Kane. Despite this, Winkler's audition won Marshall over as he embodied Fonzie's attitude even if he didn't quite fit the desired look. Before his successful acting career, Winkler worked as an extra on a game show in New York City for a mere 10. His transformation from a game show extra to a beloved television star is a testament to his determination and talent. Henry Winkler's career had several breakthrough moments that showcased his versatility and talent. In 1974, Winkler was cast as Arthur Fonzarelli, or the Fonz, in the TV show Happy Days. His portrayal of the cool, leather-jacketed character became iconic and made Winkler a household name. Director Ron Howard, who worked with Winkler on Happy Days, praised his ability to bring depth to the character, stating, Henry found the heart and humanity within the fonts. 
In the late 1970s, Winkler directed several episodes of Happy Days, showcasing his directorial prowess. However, he faced typecasting challenges due to his Fonts persona. Winkler later shared, I was trying to prove that I was more than the Fonts. In 1981, Winkler starred in the film The One and Only, which was a turning point in his career. He played a lead role outside of Happy Days, demonstrating his range as an actor. Critics took notice, with the New York Times praising his performance as touchingly funny. Winkler's career continued to evolve with roles in TV shows like Monty, MacGyver, and Arrested Development. In 2003, he began playing a hilariously inept acting coach, Gene Cousineau, in the HBO series Barry. His performance in Barry has earned him critical acclaim and two Primetime Emmy Awards for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Comedy Series. Collaborators and critics alike have praised Winkler's ability to shine in various roles throughout his career. His work has not only entertained audiences, but also inspired other actors. Bill Hader, Winkler's Barry co-star and creator, shared, He's just so good, and he makes everyone around him better. Henry Winkler, born and raised in New York City, and upstate in a family's country home, is best known for his role as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli in the hit TV show Happy Days. Interestingly, Mickey Dolenz of the Monkees originally auditioned for the part, but his height proved to be a problem. Producers wanted Fonzie to be at eye level with his peers, leading them to search for a shorter actor, ultimately hiring Winkler, who stood at 5'6", 3 inches shorter than Dolenz. In 2008, a bronze statue of Fonzie was unveiled in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, where Happy Days is set. The event was attended by Winkler, other main cast members, and director Gary Marshall. The day included an autograph signing, a parade, and a ceremony at the Brewers Miller Park where the cast threw out the first pitch and Anson Williams sang the national anthem. The statue now stands along the Milwaukee River Riverwalk, a testament to the enduring popularity of the show and Winkler's iconic character. Henry Winkler, best known for his role as Fonzie in the TV show Happy Days, has a unique artistic vision and process. He approaches his work with a lot of preparation immersing himself in the character's background and psychology. What makes his style unique is his ability to bring a certain warmth and likability to his characters, making them relatable to the audience. His personal experiences, such as his struggle with dyslexia, have significantly influenced his work. He has used his platform to raise awareness about learning disabilities and has even written a series of children's books featuring a dyslexic protagonist. This personal experience gives depth to his roles and projects, adding a layer of authenticity that resonates with the audience. Winkler's worldview is also reflected in his work. He believes in the power of positive thinking and often brings this perspective to his roles. His characters often embody resilience and determination, reflecting his own optimistic outlook on life. In summary, Henry Winkler's artistic process is characterized by thorough preparation and a unique ability to make his characters relatable. His personal experiences and worldview add depth and authenticity to his work, making it resonate with the audience. Henry Winkler, best known for his role as the Fonts in Happy Days, had a personal policy of not performing the character in public. However, he made an exception when he and three co-stars were faced with 25,000 fans at a Dallas shopping mall. In a Fonts voice, he told the crowd to separate, and they obeyed. Winkler has also been recognized for his work with British children with learning challenges. In 2011, he received an honorary order of the British Empire from Queen Elizabeth II for his efforts with the My Way campaign. Despite the fame he gained from Happy Days, Winkler remained close with his co-stars Marion Ross and Tom Bosley, often referring to them as his parents off the set. Overall, Winkler's career and personal life demonstrate his commitment to using his platform for good whether it be through his acting or his advocacy work. Henry Winkler, best known for his role as Fonzie in the popular 70s show Happy Days, made a significant contribution to the television industry. Winkler's portrayal of the cool, leather-jacketed Fonzie resonated with audiences and helped define the show as a cultural touchstone. Winkler's impact went beyond just his acting. He demonstrated his influence in the industry by breaking stereotypes and showcasing a more nuanced, and complex character than the typical two-dimensional depictions of the time. Winkler's Fonzie was a character with depth, displaying both a tough exterior and a sensitive interior, which helped to humanize him 
and make him relatable to viewers. Moreover, Winkler's performance paved the way for future characters and storytelling techniques. His portrayal of Fonzie showed that a character could be both cool and kind, breaking the mold of the traditional tough guy trope. This shift in characterization has since become a staple in modern storytelling, influencing the development of complex and dynamic characters in various forms of media. Industry experts and those inspired by Winkler have praised his contributions to the field. For instance, actor and producer Sean Hayes once said, Henry Winkler's performance as Fonzie was groundbreaking. He brought a depth and humanity to the character that challenged the status quo and inspired a generation of actors and writers. In addition to his acting career, Winkler has also made a significant impact as a producer and author. He has written a series of best-selling children's books which have helped to inspire and educate young readers. Winkler's work as a producer has also led to the creation of several successful television shows, further solidifying his status as a versatile and influential figure in the industry. In conclusion, Henry Winkler's contribution to the entertainment industry is undeniable. From his iconic role as Fonzie to his work as a producer and author, Winkler has left a lasting impact on the industry and its trends, techniques, and storytelling. His influence continues to resonate with audiences and inspire future generations of artists and creators. Henry Winkler is best known for his role as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli in the popular TV show Happy Days. Despite Fonzie's love for motorcycles, Winkler himself was actually afraid of them. Many scenes of Fonzie riding a motorcycle were filmed with the bike attached to a platform and being pulled by a truck. Off screen, Winkler is friends with several celebrities, including Ron Howard, Anson Williams, Christina Ferrer, Don Most, and John Ritter. He is also a proud grandfather of six grandchildren. Winkler's career has spanned over five decades, and he continues to act and produce television shows and movies. His work has brought joy and entertainment to people of all ages, leaving a lasting impact on the world of television. Henry Winkler, best known for his role as Fonzie in the popular 70s show Happy Days, has a rich life outside of acting. He is a dedicated family man, married to his wife Stacy for over four decades, and a father of three. Winkler is also an author, having co-written a series of children's books about a young boy with dyslexia, a condition he himself has struggled with. Philanthropy is a significant part of Winkler's life. He is passionate about children's welfare and education and has been involved with various organizations such as the Children's Action Network and the Screen Actors Guild Foundation's Book Bulls program. He also serves as the national spokesperson for the advocacy group Children and Adults with Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. Winkler's personal values and interests often intersect with his professional work. His experiences with dyslexia have influenced his roles in advocacy, and he has been open about his struggles in hopes of helping others. His work in children's literacy and his roles in family-friendly productions reflect his commitment to children's welfare. In addition to his acting and writing, Winkler is a passionate advocate for mental health awareness. He has spoken publicly about his own struggles with dyslexia and anxiety and has been involved with organizations such as the American Academy of Child and Adolescent Psychiatry. Winkler's philanthropic efforts and personal values are a testament to his dedication to making a positive impact on the lives of others. His work, both on and off screen, continues to inspire and make a difference. Henry Winkler is best known for his role as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli in the hit TV show Happy Days. However, not all cast members got along with Winkler. Roz Kelly, who played Pinky Tuscadero, had a strained relationship with him. Kelly, who was from a different background than Winkler, was eventually written off the show due to infighting with the cast. In addition to his acting career, Winkler also ventured into producing with his debut theatrical movie. Despite the implied age differences on the show, the actor's real ages varied. For instance, Anson Williams, who played Potsy, was four years older than both Ron Howard and Don Most, who played Richie and Ralph, respectively. Winkler, who played the older Fonzie, was also four years older than Williams in real life. These age differences were not reflected in the show's storyline. Henry Winkler, best known for his role as the Fonz in the TV show Happy Days, has left a significant impact on the entertainment industry. His legacy includes not only his acting talent, but also his work as a director and producer. 
He's shown that he can excel in various aspects of the industry, and his career stands as an inspiration to aspiring professionals. When it comes to the future, Winkler continues to act, write, and produce, leaving a lasting impression on new generations. He has even authored a series of children's books, further demonstrating his dedication to storytelling and education. For those hoping to follow in his footsteps, Winkler offers valuable advice never give up on your dreams, no matter how difficult the journey may seem. Embrace every opportunity to learn and grow, and always stay true to yourself. He emphasizes the importance of persistence, self-belief, and adaptability in the ever-evolving entertainment landscape. In essence, Henry Winkler's impact on the industry is undeniable. His ability to adapt and excel in various roles serves as a testament to his talent and passion. Aspiring professionals can learn from his determination and commitment to his craft, ensuring that they, too, can make their mark in the world of entertainment. Henry Winkler is best known for playing the character of Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli in the hit TV show Happy Days. He played this same character in five different series, including Happy Days, Laverne and Shirley, Mork and Mindy, The Fonz, and The Happy Days Gang, and Joni Loves Chachai. Winkler and Tom Bosley are the only cast members to appear in all 255 episodes of Happy Days, with Mary and Ross missing only two episodes. Interestingly, Winkler was also considered for the role of Danny in the film version of Grease around the same time that Marie Osmond was being considered for Sandy. However, both actors turned down the roles. Winkler's portrayal of Fonzie in Happy Days made him a household name, and he remains a beloved figure in television history. His enduring popularity is a testament to his talent and charisma as an actor. Henry Winkler's journey in the entertainment industry is a testament to the power of passion and perseverance. Starting as an actor, he found fame as the fonts in the iconic show Happy Days. But Winkler didn't stop there. He went on to direct, produce, and write, demonstrating his innovative spirit and versatility. Winkler's impact on the industry is significant. He's not only entertained millions, but also inspired many with his dedication and resilience. Despite facing challenges, he never gave up, showing that creativity and persistence can lead to great success. His work, including his children's book series, Hank Zipser, has touched the hearts of many, leaving a lasting impression. Winkler's ability to connect with audiences across generations is a true testament to his talent and enduring appeal. In the end, Henry Winkler's journey reminds us that creativity and perseverance can lead to remarkable achievements. His story encourages us all to pursue our passions, overcome obstacles, and make a meaningful impact in our own unique ways. Henry Winkler's role as Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli in Happy Days brought a significant change to the show. Initially, the series had low ratings and was at risk of cancellation. However, once Winkler's character gained popularity, viewership increased and the show continued for nine more seasons. Roz Kelly, who played Pinky Tuscadero, was intended to become a recurring character in Happy Days. Unfortunately, this plan never materialized. In later interviews, Kelly expressed her disagreements with Winkler, stating, I was from the wrong side of the tracks, and he was a rich kid. That rubbed me the wrong way. In the MacGyver episode Harry's Will, Henry Winkler made a guest appearance as the attorney handling Harry's Will. The will included a 1957 Chevy Nomad station wagon, which Harry left to MacGyver. Winkler's appearance added an interesting twist to the episode, making it memorable for viewers. Let's hear your thoughts on the talented Henry Winkler and his impressive work in the entertainment industry. With a career spanning over five decades, he's made his mark as an actor, producer, and director. From his iconic role as the fonts in Happy Days to his more recent work in shows like Barry, he continues to captivate audiences of all ages. Henry Winkler's legacy in the entertainment world is worth celebrating. His ability to take on diverse roles and his dedication to his craft have made him a beloved figure. Whether you've been a fan since his Happy Days days or discovered him more recently, we'd love to hear your favorite moments and what his work means to you. If you enjoy our content, please show your support by liking, sharing, and subscribing for more articles celebrating the creative minds shaping entertainment. Let's keep the conversation going. Share your thoughts on Henry Winkler's work and legacy in the comments below.